Welcome back to the channel everybody. Uh, today I'm bitten the uh, 2017, 18, 19, I guess a 19 plus bumper on the uh, on my 64. What I did was a lot of people said they built up just right, some people said they didn't fit. So I put one on and it's a little easier than explain. The bolt holes almost line up perfect. I'm sorry. I had to fix the plastic right there. Anyways, what I did here was I had it leaned on the tow hooks, which is a great place to hang it real quick. What I did was I put, see the top was leaning in right there. I threw the bolt in and tilted the bumper slightly to get this bottom one in. And then I just tighten the bottom one in, then the top one will slide right on. No, a lot of people my friend, he's got aftermarket intercooler, so it's a bit deeper. So we had to put spacers behind these to get them to pull it out a little bit. And plus, it's got offset wheels, so it rubs a little bit. But other than that, if you get a pretty straightforward truck, you can bolt this on pretty easily. And uh, the little brackets on the side, they just bolt right up. And there, those won't be a problem. Little brackets that go from here to here this point they'll just bolt right up they ain't, they ain't no problem and the fog lights what I did was I got aftermarket fog lights where it's got this cable running sorry this cable runs down because if you try to put them in OEMs they won't line up they'll be way too long so I got these aftermarket LEDs and just bolt them right up and they'll clip right into the factory harness I get this tightened up and I'll show you all. All right, and there you have it all bolted up. And one more note to add, if you have, have a license plate like we do in Texas, there's, we gotta trim the back of it here. Can't so if you see it hits the intercooler, there's a little, little rubber right there. You just cut it off, sand it down a little bit, and it'll fit. Anyways, just a little quick video for y'all. Hope you enjoyed it and have a great day. 